This is high command on 50, Boodoo. Both teams read. Copy that. This is red team. Go ahead. Roger, wait one red team. I'm gonna have to teleport closer because green four is using a fucking short range. All right, all right, all right. Let's get this show on the road. Some last minute changes, blah, blah, blah. Green four, comms check. Independent slash green four, comms check. Five by five. Roger, red four, one last comms check. Red four, checking it. Solid copy, white one. All right, let me just make sure stream's playing okay. All right, everything's live. Wonderful. All right, this is high command. Uh, are both teams ready for their briefing? Greenfall ready. Go ahead. Solid copy. Uh, today we're going to be doing two PMC PvP missions. We have a new map and some changes to the mod set. So if everyone can open their maps, please. Uh, on the, we'll see multiple circles and a few different things noted on the map pertaining to the bottom left. Uh, first thing to note, one, we've got a red circle around the Op 4 base, and we've got a green circle around the green 4 base. Green 4s will make yours slightly bigger, because I think I made the red ones too fat, but those represent a, uh, air safety uh, areas. So um, you cannot be engaged by enemy aircraft in that area. If that rule is violated like last week, I will just Zeus the fucking helicopter. And both sides have limited assets, so be aware. The blue circle represents today's engagement AO. So if you notice, there's only one bridge. So if you take land vehicles, please note that you can only engage. I will draw a more dotted, firm line within that area. Otherwise, that whole bottom left island is up for grabs from enemy and, or from enemy uh, PvP craft and PvE. Uh, be advised, two markers on the map are as follows. The first one, the blue objective marker, is where your objective is. Uh, today's objective for the first mission is to capture a new type of vehicle you'll know it where you see it but it is kept somewhere in ramon's plantation we believe there are four vehicles total uh the win requirement is you at least bring one of them outside of wherever it is stored and bring it back to base by any means necessary uh both teams do not win if all vehicles are destroyed or nato slash us successfully pull them out of the ao the second marker on the map represents a nato military base that's where they're going to be sending reinforcements from so i would try to stay away from that any questions uh negative on our end let me increase their damn Fuck, alright, hold on. Greenfall wants to know if we all have boats. <sighs> yeah, I was thinking about that. Uh, solid copy, wait one. Uh, Roger, I thought about that, but thought it would be difficult. Give me three minutes. Could you repeat independence question? Because I didn't help to it. Uh, we're gonna add boats. Hold on. Copy. Not land boats. And then I need STVs. Alright, and then just control C. And control V that bitch. So just adjust it like so. The only issue is that's included in their area, so I'm going to. 
make a quick change here. Because I have a feeling if I let them, they will spawn camp the goddamn boats. So I'm going to need some green dots again. Cool. Uh, let's see. This is High Command. Be advised, boats have been added to both factions at the representative markers. Uh, Green 4, I've also extended your defensive border. Uh, be advised, both teams have the following vehicles. Four times speedboat miniguns, four times SDVs, one times BTR-70, three times open UAZ transports, two times Dushka UAZs, one times AEG or AGS UAZ, one times SPG-9 GAZ, two times MI8 trans MI transports, uh, one times MH6 Little Bird and one times AH6 Little Bird, as well as an ammo, refuel, and repair Vic at their base for anything they need. Uh, be advised, you may now conduct recon at this time and start deploying your forces so long as they stay outside of the AO. Uh, we will conduct the AO itself in approximately 15 minutes. The time is 3.08, so at 3.23, I will radio in giving you the go-ahead. Be advised, I'm also increasing the, uh, or more outline the border at the bridge in case of any disputes. Ah, now here's the fun part. Gotta just bullet the hell out of this line. So, give me one second. I do it like this, that way if someone accidentally deletes something, there are no questions. User joined your channel. Uh, we'll do it until they get landlocked. There we go. Not really any dispute there. Anyway, let me start interacting with chat. I apologize. I, you know, like to get pumped up here. But chat, I need your help. Uh, we need to stack this base up a bit. And I've already got a few ideas for what I want to put around it. But I'm going to need some help in choosing the helicopters we're going to want to use. Ready for order. So first things first, let's get this nice little artillery spot all tidied up. And I'll also turn the music down slightly. Hold on. Ever so slightly. You never want the music to be too loud, you know what I mean? Alright, now that that's done, what are we going to put in here? Anti-air, goat guns. <laughs> I'm not sure if we can do goat guns. Here's what I'm thinking. We'll do a Kamachi, vanilla vehicle, anti, you know, fuck you sort of weapon let's just look at nato helicopters see if anything comes out army of the czech republic can't really do that an aw what do you look like you look sexy and you sound sexy let's do it british royal navy with some kick-ass decal on the side yeah ied butterflies good god yeah, Pavlo for reinserts. That's what I'm thinking. But uh, we'll have to see what we can use via the reinforcement menu. Let's look at the RHS fix. Uh, scroll down, U.S. Army. Uh, let's see. We're going to mainly want to use an AA for one. And for two, OIF Gray. That sounds sexy. Oh, she is very, very sexy. Yes. Decaled the shit out of her. Cut their fuel so they all don't scramble at the same time. Also makes them targets of opportunity if the bait, if one of the factions really wants to fuck over the entire AO. Now, let's go with some reinforcements here. So, first off, I need to stack. Ready for order. 
Let's do a company HQ with a freaking marksman team. AI garrison. Just, you know, have them around in the base. And then in terms of Vix, what should we stack the base with? Let's see the fun things we have available. APCs, M113s, eh, they're okay. I mean, I think we could do better, though. Let me just scoop my chair in. <laughs> Here's the thing. We don't have a runway, so I don't have any A-10s to properly mobilize yet. Green Fort looks like they've already gotten their drone up. Up for is sending a blue for drone. Okay, that's weird. Armored, the M1117. Yes. It's always a good puppy to start with. Cars, we can do uh, another Mark II, have it on standby. You know, start with the easier vehicles, and we'll get into the MRAPs and the IFVs. Here we go. These are always fun. The Bradleys. <laughs> They're always fun. Standing by. Ready. Keep it simple. But then get more and more advanced. MRAP to put in the way. We'll put uh, M2 down. Ready to go. Let's move this column back so we can stack the more armored MRAP. Ready for order. The 3-7. And we can also cram these guys with reinserts as well. And then our mighty fucking Abrams with Tusk. Ready. Because hey, you never know. Awaiting orders. The beasts. So that should be a good line of anti fuck you. Ready to go. <laughs> this isn't a tier two, it's a tier one. But these are all just potential reinforcements to use. That's if the thought. Yeah, God, English, Liru. This is only for if the player base really starts fucking up Royale. Now, I've got some pretty decent groups in here, so what I'm going to really do is. Solid copy. Stack the AO with some patrolling groups. Just some simple patrolling teams. Nothing too special. And then we'll have one internal patrolling squad. Waiting. Understood. Understood. Copy. Kind of going through the perimeter here. And then one small patrolling team around Roger. the goods. On the way. Roger that. Perfect. As you can tell, I freaking grouped a shit ton of AI together and just garrisoned them all in this base. And this is one of the few times where the new garrison, where it um, just spaces all the units out instead of having them hug the same building, is actually beneficial because you can just quickly blanket an AO. Which, you know, kind of nice, but I'd prefer the individual just group a few guys together and put them in house by house. But, ah. Uh, Different Zeus's will have different tastes for things. So, this is our AO we've got, and I hope you guys enjoy. Right, the global scale. God, that I thought about it, and then I forgot about it. Classic 75 spotting will be down to 30. We want this to focus on PvP. Accuracy will be 35. But anyway... Isn't that just kick-ass? Hold on, there's one more There's one more touch I wanted to do. Uh, NATO pilots, because they kind of look flight suity. Men. Where are you, you motherfuckers? Waiting. Waiting orders. <laughs> now, isn't that just... That's thumbnail-worthy right there. Frames are hurting a little bit. User left your channel. Yeah, all right. Let me make some minor adjustments here. I don't need all of these AI for starters. User I can cut down on a bit. Mainly the roamers. Uh, I can get rid of you. Move you a bit to the side. Keep you there. 
If I've got pilots in here, I can take out two of User those guys. Ah, let's see. Move you bumblefucks around. I don't need you. Where are you tied to? This guy, I don't need him. Don't need him. Minor garrisons on the sides. Ah, no, we'll put you over here. And that should be okay. Looking for any doubles up and uh, double ups in the bunkers. Little micro adjustments. They still have a good seven minutes for recon. Set you to crouch. And for now, I think everything should be good, more or less. You guys don't know how to waypoint. You you can't be this bumble fucking retarded, please. Because you're supposed to be going to that one according to your path, and how are you getting stuck? Ah, AI will be AI. Other than that, I think we have a decent NATO base, and we'll, uh, you know, maneuver things accordingly. I'm not going to set LZs. I'm going to let the AI pick them themselves. It's probably a mistake, but, you know, worst comes to worst. So they're all going to opt for an MI-8. Why did they ask me for boats if they're just going to take a fucking MI-8? Ah, Malaka. These guys have their ammo truck. I don't know why they need it. I already... Oh. Nice. Hi, Command 2, Op 4. I just fixed what the fuck you just did. Uh, don't do that again. I mean, okay. This kind of explains a lot. Idiots. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. Dumbasses. Ah, uh, but we'll see how things go. Uh, I was thinking some of them might bring land vix, but I don't see either faction going for that right off the bat. Why the hell are you dressing up as NATO? Auntie is being auntie, that's why. Ah, well, she'll get her ass kicked. Maybe, I don't know. We are adding spec ops goats. Yes, yes we are. I really don't know what to do with them, though. I thought about it all day. I mean... Here's what I think we can do with them. First off, I'm going to have to disable their simulation. Okay, I know what to do with them. We'll do what we normally do with them. Raise them up a bit. Give me three fucking NATO AT, or not AT, but automatic turrets. Turrets. Oh, God. Ready. Well, I, I don't think a goat could... <laughs> uh... Ready. Hey, guys. You want to do something really, really stupid? Like, beyond stupid? Let's do something really, really stupid. Standing by. That's the 40 mic mic. Ready. Ready for orders. Automated mobile AA, because why the hell not? Alright. We're going to have to disable the sim for these three guys. Uh... 
hold on. No, this needs to be an art here. Nobody, come on. What have we created? I'll tell you what we've created. We created a fucking monster. It, it doesn't even... <laughs> Alright, fuck it. Ah, uh, AA goats. God damn it. And then the other two will make simple escort auto turret goats. Because, you know, we're already that crazy. They call me Frankenstein, and these are my monsters. Cool. And then the other one. Ah, I mean, it's not supposed to be it's, it's easy when they have the max. Uh, how much time was still left for before we could set off? And saw a copy one post. minute. Copy. He has it on his head. You know, I think we're going to keep it that way. <sighs> All right. The monsters are here. Our fucking random ass AA goat creations. Here's his assistant. His head is literally a missile. Goat Max. Has science gone too far? That's a good question. Let's give him the go ahead. This is high command of both factions. You are clear to proceed. I repeat, you are clear to proceed. Stop it. Now, before I die a horrible, horrible death, first let's make me invincible, and B, let's hide my fucking ass. Now let's teleport ourselves back into this godforsaken AO. His name is Owen Cooper. <laughs> Are you all Owen Cooper? You're Mike Moore. Okay. So I, I, it's the name of the turret. So you're Owen Cooper. You don't have a name. And you are Ian Martin. All right. Let's fix that. We can't give them names. That's too barbaric. Oh, I can't change the name of the turrets. What about the goats? Yun, Anderson, Mitchell, and Collins. Wow. That's great. If you want me to make more, I need more people to sub. That's the general rule with these goddamn atrocities. Ah, <laughs> uh, Mechmore. That's a good one, though. We know what'll happen if I give this a suppress order. It's gonna kill itself. Of course, we're probably still gonna do it for the lulls, but still. I don't want to be near that thing. I'll probably bloodlust myself. Alright, Mr. FR. Coming in quick with the MI. Meanwhile, Gavalor is giving a very wide berth. I don't know where he's flying to, because I think he'd want to fly in that section. Uh, I don't know. Because if he comes in hot, I mean, we've got a bunch of M3AA and tow missile launchers. And this thing. Plus, we've got the frickin' 50 cal. So I think he's swinging around entirely deploy on the green force side. Which may or may not be a bad idea. So a few of them need to bandit. Look at that. Triple bandage right off the bat. Looks like FR is now pulling out. 
so green four is in the AO and ready to go. Meanwhile, Gav... He's got a transport, and he's coming into the corner of the AO. Meanwhile, the other guys, it looks like they're taking a boat. Nope, Auntie Static killed herself. <laughs> How do you fuck this up? You had a boat, and you killed yourself while getting in the boat. <laughs> oh, that's, that's intelligent. Good job, team. Good fucking job. Ah, uh, I did say I'd put two teams down. Isn't this worth two fucking teams? I mean, come on. Yeah, first blood, ocean. Hold on, <laughs> hold on, hold on. Uh... Auntie just dies. <laughs> They're gonna swim in. They all chose dive gear. Ah, crafty little bastards. Then why didn't Auntie go with them? Let's see. Four, five, six, seven. Yeah, she could have fit with them. Or she could have gone with Gavilor and been dropped off like somewhere over here. So that's interesting. They're gonna directly assault from the south then. Bypass this main entrance here. Ah, uh, let's see. Meanwhile, Green 4, they're going to do a main assault, but... They're going all eggs in one basket. Eight people, seven people, Auntie's down, so she's probably going to get redeployed. I don't know, we'll have to see what goes on. Green 4, they're moving their drone around, but if these guys stay under, uh, yeah, there's no way in hell the drone's going to see them. See, if you know what you're looking for, you can make them out, but to me, at first glance, this looks like the fucking ocean light at that drone's range. There's no way in hell. The drone's going to try to get eyes on, but there is absolutely no way in hell. You can see the slight discolorations, the backpacks and whatnot, but looks like these guys went full CSAT gear with their dive gear. Nice. The hell was that? Oh, he's firing at the drone, and he gets it. Roger. So they're going to recuperate. Ah, oh, uh, no, they're still moving in, but these guys, we're going to be looking towards the coast now because that damn drone, not sure if that was planned as a strategy or if that was uh, on accident. That had to have been on accident, because if that was planned, that means they would directly know what these guys are doing, which means A, they're tapped Come on, in... Just to clarify, air combat allowed outside of the AO. A firm, all air combat is allowed except for the green and red reins. Over. Roger. On the way. I should have given, uh, here, here. Let's, uh, put down a sock on boat. Yeah. Waiting. Who's ready for hashtag not a boat? <laughs> Hopefully won't get that damn glitch, but I'm going to send them over. So we need to go check out what the fuck that drone was. Yeah, flare base means smart something's wrong. If that was intentional, then that was screen, uh, that was screen sniping or stream sniping, whatever the fuck it's called. Because there's no way Green 4 would have known. Unless, like, their render distance was up the wazoo or something. Or... Or FR saw him on radar. Those are the only two things I can think of for that to be legitimate. Is that quote a thing already? Uh, no, not a boat. I don't have that down yet because it only happened once. But I'll probably add it. <laughs> Here's the issue, though. 
at their trajectory and vector, they're going to come up right at the main base. Gav! Gav! Oh no, that's FR. Get shot down by the base. I mean, that's a fucking military base. I don't even know what the fuck got him. I don't even know who shot those rockets. All I know is FR just probably lost the little bird. It had to have been the Chinook and the freaking Huey thingamabob right here. Second blood goes to NATO. On the way. So we're going to mobilize one of these puppies to go check out what the fuck that was about. Copy that. That was an enemy fucking chopper. Flew way too close. Yeah, I know. It's it. It's probably not a uh, stream sniper or whatever. It was just coincidence, but still. Then again, that same pilot just flew right into a fucking military base, and that's the good old retarded player base we know and love. Yeah, I think Gavilor's just going to pick up Auntie at this rate, because Auntie can't seem... Is Auntie just stuck now? She can't even get back to the shore. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Gav's gonna pick her up. Oh, God. The AA's on the move. <laughs> let's, uh, let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? Uh, it does. Welcome. Yeah, the goats are definitely on the fucking move. Dun, 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 dun. It's pushing it. Dun, dun, dun. The goat cavalry. I can't. <laughs> God damn it. We can't give them move orders. They just do what they do. And that is they just be goats. So these guys are going to be on high alert. They're picking. Literally, this is the entrance to the compound area. Guys, lesson number one about assaulting objectives. Never assault the fucking entrance. Because it's next to a road where I can quickly reinforce. And it's going to have something armored to defend it. Let's, uh, let's the Huey one Thinamabob's one. a Wildcat upgraded version of the Super Lynx, which is essentially the armor 3. Yeah. Okay, you're right. I'm retarded. And I just missed whoever did that follow because I was contemplating. I'm so sorry. Thank you for the follow, my friend. Hope you enjoyed the stream. And that is exactly what I was fucking worried about. Murphy literally got sniped through the trees from this fucking 113. She's going to mobilize and drive right up to him because she gives no fucks. This team's going to come over to reinforce, checking out the noise. People already guns up. You're not even looking in the right fucking direction. Barty. Barty. Barty! Goodbye, Barty. Can you not even hear that thing? You're three Sorry, men down. Welcome, I see three. Welcome. Gets out the M113. Primes it. And he takes a face full of fucking lead. Andrew and Miro still have AT capability. This is why you never assault the main entrance of a fucking base. He got hit in the arm, probably by that last burst. Taking more MG fire. Where are the smokes? They get him back up. Giant, but he is in a world of hurt. US, don't fucking mess around. It's been a while. Have the player base changed? Not really. We're down to three guys. Root is down. Smokes? Anyone? Ah. It was a cool insertion idea. Really bad drop so, zone. Let's give him a warm welcome, shall tank we? Buster, welcome. We're trying to tank Buster here, but uh, player base doesn't seem capable at the moment. This just proves they completely failed the recon aspect by not noticing this M113. Roger. 
Hey, buddy, go do a meet and greet. Okay, I'll do it for you. <laughs> now nah, he's arching up by himself. He's gonna fire from the fucking ocean. Hey! Take the shot! Take the shot! You did not- Okay. There's a bit of desync right there. Now you need to get the fuck away from that before it cooks off. Uh, guys. Yeah, this isn't gonna end well for a lot of you. Yeah. There goes Murphy, that explosion hurt Giant. Green 4 is still advancing, but uh, frickin' Red 4, uh, Op 4, excuse me, are gonna take the blunt of the heat. However, if they assault in this direction, this is where reinforcements are gonna start coming in. Let's send in our little friend from base here. Get him going as some light QRF. Got another puppy right here, gonna fully fuel this guy. And we're going to move him in on standby. They're down to two men working on medic duties, but... Let's also throw in a, an army team as QRF, send them in. No, we'll send in a full squad. Have them move into the front of the base and double time it in a staggered column. Go back to global settings so we can set those units that just showed up. Alright, basic medical. They were able to get two of their guys back up. They can go up and get nafs, but otherwise they need to hurry because they're about to be caught in a fucking sandwich between blue four and independent. Uh, if I were independent, I'd use this distraction. I'd maneuver around or cut through right here. I mean, there's not that many places I could hide a fucking mech. Uh, that barn... These two lawn barns, or these two buildings, uh, both could easily store it. Where are the mechs? Let me show off the mechs again. Mechs are right in here with some pilots. Uh, I might even crew one of them and manually, uh, drive it around to fuck with them. Oh yeah, I would think this SAWCOM boat's gonna come by and say hello, so... AA just hit this chopper! She's going down, trying to stabilize. There's no water gear. There she goes. Pilots are going to be able to swim up the shore. I'm going to be lenient about this. Let's have them start coming back. On the way. What? Who shot down a fucking... Was that you? Yeah, that was you. Well, now two of these choppers are going to go in combat air patrol. And go try to figure out what the fuck that was. Solid copy. On the way. On the way! On the way! So, I don't know why you would shoot an unprovoked chopper. Ah, uh, now the Sockon boat's coming in. Yeah. Andrew's trying to play dead. And Rube wakes back up. He's shot. And killed. Bottom line, again, never attack the main entrance of a fucking base. So, frickin', I'm gonna have Op4 redo their goddamn insertion, because that was... That was borderline stupid. Uh, Jester's group doesn't PvP, they only do PvE. So yeah, Op4 just decided to do a full reinsert here, because... Yep, yeah, there we go. Not a boat. Not a boat. Not a boat. 
Everything's not a boat. <laughs> Otherwise, this group's down. They've got Strella for AT, or AA, excuse me. And they've stuck with mainly Russian weaponry. That's nice. AS Vals, but, uh, yeah, these guys got fucked, so... We'll go. Understood. Have the boat kind of pull in a bit. But this thing, two fucking 50 cals, a minigun, and an a, uh, AGS. It is nothing to be trifled with. On the way. So I'm going to have this guy kind of come up to the coast. This team that's coming in, I want them to come over and assess the situation over here. We have a few men down we got to take care of. Can you move your fucking fat ass? Uh, this is Red Sport Command. My pony got shut down up on our base. Ah! Ah, uh, solid copy. That was the AI. Wait, one. Ah, <laughs> uh, NATO. This is high command, it's been replaced. The hell did you do? I think you just AA'd this. But it's potentially repairable now, and the pilots. That would actually be really fucking cool if FR kills these two guys and then takes that Vic by repairing it, he could potentially steal it. I can't keep moving you, dude. Hold on. You gotta fix your game beforehand. So they're waiting for Jester here to come up. Not 814, a different Jester. Four people ask. Quickly move out of that. Ah, alright. Let's see how these things go. Uh, so the mecha the title is covered. About, uh, the nukes are the second mission. Ron sh oh, for fuck's sake. Fix your fucking T-Far. User was moved to your channel. Hold on, let me disable my sounds again because they seem to have re enabled themselves. Ah. But yep, they just have to take one of the mechs back to base. There's multiple ways they could go about this. And it looks like we've got some guys getting stuck in base. That's fine. Not a boat. So now it's really not a good idea to assault this base from the front. To be perfectly honest, none of these areas are really good to assault from. I would recommend taking a boat and assaulting from the other side. Uh, that way you can then cut through, quickly get to cover with the least amount of resistance, and push in using the buildings as cover. You'll scramble the base, but that's a better bet than these outside outposts. But yeah, front base was definitely not a good idea. Understood. Mobilize that thing going. How far is GOAT Team 6 moved? Well, that... Does that answer your question? He, he's literally bobbing up and down. Hey man, the upper body strength of this guy. Aye, aye, aye. GOAT Team 6 have literally... They're crossing the area, that's for sure. Can I close the doors? I'm not sure if I can. I can try. But I don't think there's an option to actually do that. I think I tried last night after the stream ended. But yeah, it's just the inventories of the mix. That'd be cool, but unfortunately it just doesn't have that feature. These are all in single pilot mode. It would have been cool, though. 
Yeah, goats are sick of the base, so they fucking left. <laughs> Otherwise, we're trying to get the player base moving in now. Looks like they're going to try to cut through right here. The only issue is we have a fucking 113. Or M2 machine gun. And I have a feeling he's searching. Right where the player base might try to advance. I see one of them. Yeah, and he sees him. This is at 30% spotting. And the AI are still pretty unforgiving. So Trenton goes down. They're going to pop smoke. He reported something that's going to be radioed in. On the way. Send this armored Vic up. Nafs got killed again. That would be the Kamachi. <laughs> Roger that. NATO's AA is fucking on point tonight. I hope they have their loadout saved. What Vic did they even take? The little bird. Yeah, they might want to consider going at a different angle because that bird shot him down. Solid car. Otherwise, I'm going to put him over right there. That M3 is still going nuts. Looks like it down. Frisk. Nope, that would have been this puppy. Yeah, so this is the only one where we start, uh, this is the only stream where we start an hour earlier than normal. That's because, for time purposes, I have to. Where the fuck is my reinforcement squad? Why the hell are you guys not moving to the front? I mean, I'm, I'm gonna put you guys over here now, but can you guys follow that order at least? Thank you. Heck, let's throw the book at these guys. But that 113 is literally tearing them apart. Yep, helicopters are pretty fucking lethal. I'm just trying to waste the assets at this point because it's clear that the player base can't handle them. And I know they have Estrella. Is he down though? That's the real question. So they're flying in. Here's that Kamachi coming in. These guys are still within the firing line of that M2, though. Uh, yeah, of course it's going to YouTube. Op4 going for a land vehicle approach? Yeah, I figured. So now NATO forces are running in. Frisk is the one with the Strella, but he's down. Vicks are all starting to move in. They're just making the hole wider. Got more forces coming in. Let's do a suppressive fire order. I want to see what he does. We're going to pretend that never, ever happened. Never, ever fucking happened. I don't know why. I, I don't know why, and I don't care. I don't fucking care. It's just... Driver, just, just go. I'm sick of this shit. That's what it does, yeah. Yeah. Let's just start suppressing random buildings. But you won't blow up on me, right? On the way. I want you to backtrack and go around because you went way too far than what I wanted you to do. And you got owned. I don't think they realize that 113 is still pinning them down right here. Yeah. 
That never happened, yeah. Don't worry about it. Seriously, smoke! What the hell? The hell just happened? It put me back into my unit as Zeus without me hitting the Y button. So they shot out the wheels. Again, potential to commandeer. These guys have to stay in heavy cover. Alright, so we got a land convoy going. Zompocalypse, welcome. So they're taking the SPG-9. Uh, Dushka. And the AGS. Yep, they're going full Bono. Let's mobilize our Humvee and get it ready to go. Send it after the player base because they're both attacking pretty much where the fucking entrance is. Roger. Otherwise, they've got a bit of breather room. That squad has turned into a fire team and they've decrewed that M113. I keep calling it that, the M2, excuse me. So these guys are going to start going down. Their freaking pilot just said he's going to go get a fucking hot dog. So that's a bit of an issue. Fire support. Artillery time. Now, curious. I think this is within his range, but I would love to see if he can fire off a shot regardless. Yep, no target in range. He just died. That shot went out. Ah. Go behind him. They're trying to fix up this thing. They're at least going to use his machine gun. I think they're tracking this M2 coming in from the Humvee. Copy. Want to kind of inch up Walk here, away. sending these other units in. Roger that. Do they not have ears? Deadwalker running in. Literally misses that first barrage. On the way. Try to have him run back. Fuck you! You you having you having a good time up there, champ? Deadwalker just died too. What the hell just happened? So they just blew up Deadwalker. They just murdered Frosty and critically injured Jet. Who's the gunner of this thing? Dead goal. It's a fucking team killer. <laughs> My god. The stupidity is real. Auntie's swimming across. I'm gonna be curious to see if any of these guys actually team kill her because she's dressed up like fucking NATO. Not a boat, not a boat, not a fucking boat. We know. See, another potential thing that I don't think some of these guys learned is I destroyed this bridge in an op a week ago. So if one of them wanted to be a real dick, they could destroy the fucking bridge and prevent any land vehicles from coming in. Yeah, auntie's up there. Or down there. The stupidity is real. Let's see what it does. <laughs> There's a difference between not reacting in a specific situation... And just being stupid. Copy that. Otherwise, it looks like my goats have made it very, very far. 
No, go the other way. Mr. Goats. He gives no fucks. It's artillery, this compound. Wait, you have a rocket launcher, and he's just being retarded. Well, I know what we're doing. Liru is actually very good at AT. Didn't even kill me. And she's smoking. Goodbye. Cool guys don't look at explosions. But we're gonna look at it anyway. Up goes the weasel. Ah. We all know what's gonna happen if I suppressive fire that. But the moral of the story here is never attack the front base of a fucking military compound. I said it before and I'll say it again. I will keep saying it until these guys fucking learn. So, they're getting up on this area. What's our next Vic to mobilize? Hell yeah, let's put a US team of Army D in it. Ready for orders. Yeah, boy. Now let's get you in this AO. Looks like the player base is coming back to get their mortar goats. And you're doing what? Yeah, how's that working out for you? How'd that work out for you guys? Yeah. Do you have an underbarrel? We have a lot to talk about in debrief. Don't you fucking worry. Miasmus, welcome. On the way. Rest of them, it looks like they're trying to engage the Sawcom boat. It's heard a rocket. You completely missed the rocket. Good job. Green 4 are being redeployed times now. Our precious little boat. So they're running around the corner here. They put another rocket into her. She looks like she went up a bit, but otherwise... Minimal damage. All right, last thing I need to mobilize because they're literally assaulting this goddamn place, Ron. Ready. Do 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 do. BFC legend, welcome. Yeah, otherwise they left Nafs in the fucking car, and Rube died coming into this building from something. I actually don't know what got him. But he's dead too. And Andrew is now running back. Yeah, okay, get cover. I think these guys all know where the damn mechs are by now. If they don't, well, I think they're probably dumb, so. Yeah, you're the 3,000 follower. Welcome. I don't know. Fall. Did you just. Op4, you did not just rocket your own guy. How did that not bloodlust him? 
Hey, Op4, it's really amusing when you shoot your own fucking players on purpose, you know that? Oh, copy. <sighs> okay, no, we'll just roll this thing up. Copy. This thing wants to play. Oh, copy. Yeah. All right. Fuck you. This thing. Well, let's let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? On the way. Who will win in a fight? One IFV. Well, you're dead now, you fucking team killers. At least they died. These two can survive because they're cool, but the other two, not cool. Not cool. That's how I deal with people that intentionally team kill. In a fucking op. So this is giving green for the advantage to come up now, but... Now we have the goddamn frigate coming in. Now, just as a precaution, because I don't want her to outright rape the players, I'm going to take her ammo away. But notice how the fights keep happening at the main fucking entrance of this game. So I'm assuming they want this to be as difficult as fucking possible if they're going to keep pulling stupid shit like that. We're going to start medicing these guys. And Independent are also starting to push up. Meanwhile, it looks like they're starting to mobilize their other Vix. Looks like that is the Dishka. One of the two Dishkas they're taking. And they're also taking SPG-9. Jesus Christ, dude, you fired that in between your assets. You could have cooked something off. Dumbass. Moral of the story is I think everyone's being really fucking retarded right now. And AO2 will be much lighter. Yeah, they really don't learn, do they? I mean, it's not meant to be a difficult op. I mean, if you just assault this base and assault this base and then cut through, take out this bunker, take out this area, you're fine. I will probably put a reinforcement vehicle or two here, but you got the cover of this fucking bunker base to use an M113 and take it out. And you've got basic medical to then heal you. Heck, you even got tow missile launchers pointing in both different directions. One of them even flipped over. Then just go in, grab a mech, move it out, hit the X bu uh, E button, I'm sorry, G button, then X button, and then boom, you're flying, and then you just fly it back to your base. Instead, they're going through the main fucking entrance. I can't, I can't stop stupid. I'm gonna have the Anzac dock uh, kind of right here. I think it might have beached itself, but after that, we'll move it. But I'm going to make the second op, which is going to be up here. It's going to be a bit easier. Because otherwise, these guys are just bumble fucking retarded. They're still hitting my boat. It needs two more rockets and she'll get blown off. Another one hits. Now she's moving, and they pissed it off. These guys keep engaging assets. They also don't have to necessarily engage. Which is also kind of perplexing. Yes, yes, let the player base flow through you. <laughs> ah. So he's trying to get this next RPG shot in. Now 
They're trying to decrew that last gunner as well. Alright, Mr. Sakon Boat, I think you need to hide behind Big Charles, and Big Charles is about to say hello. Big Charles? Go do your thing. So otherwise, Op 4, they're slowly crouching up, moving deeper into parts of the base they don't need to move into. Here's another question. I don't know where they think they know the fucking mechs are. Yeah, they just want to kill shit. That's why they're engaged and everything. Well, that's going to cost them because these AOs are not meant to be, you know, you're able to kill everything off scot-free. They're meant to be difficult. And there goes the sock on boat. And that is an end to not a boat. I don't think Big Charles is going to appreciate his younger cousin getting blown up like that. So we got another guy right there. It's really up to Op 4. Now they're going to start taking suppressive fire. Did you guys not notice that guy right there? Thank you. FR is now coming in. Very, very close. I don't see anyone on his bird, so I'm not sure what exactly he's planning. Come on, Big Charles. Yeah, okay. Just make sure I didn't cut your fucking fuel instead of your ammo. Redeploying Trenton, who has some AT capabilities. That's nice. Have him get his rifle out. Because he's at the doorway here. Gavalor was on standby. Looks like he just fixed his... No, he just went down. Not sure if he'll DC. But more... the green four reinserts are now coming in. We'll see how these guys do. Yeah, I don't know why Op4 are using fucking British uniforms, but whatever. Let sleeping dogs lie so, at this point. Our LG, welcome. Yeah, now these guys are going to have to deal with a fucking squad size element right here. They're making progress, but Op4, uh, Green4 also needs to start pushing, and they can kind of catch them in at the same way. Yeah, so Red, Op 4 are just taking the BTR, but by then it's gonna be too late. Someone's gonna take a frickin' MRAT, uh, fucking whatchamacallit. On the way. On the way. Roger that. Gonna have him come up right here. Op 4 started their engagement from the sound of things. Nope, that's, uh, Green 4. Uh, Shooting at what specifically? I don't know. Eric, welcome. Rapid deployment. We hear that 113 going off, and it looks like it's taken down Frisk. She's now turning her gun to face where the Op 4 units are. They've killed off a few guys. They're just trying to slowly scan this area. Yeah, they definitely know they're there, though. Trying to counter suppress gets him. That's a tough position to be in. Frisk decides to kill himself. And I think Trayton just went down from the cook-off of the sock on boat. Marine, welcome. Uh, 
to high command. Uh, we our fighters need to direct back into C4. Solid copy. Nafs was the last one I did. He's gonna have to leave and rejoin the server. Ah, uh, God. I can't accommodate for people having bad connections. There's multiple ways you can put yourself back into a TFAR server. Can we listen on their comms? Here's the deal. I don't know their channels, and for the sake of their security, I'm not supposed to know their channels. All we have is their uh, long range channel. Uh, that's just to keep it fair. Because I wouldn't want someone who might be stream sniping and then listening on their comms and their plans. Uh, that's why for PvP, I don't do listening on their comms. Murphy trades, but he goes down unsure if he'll wake back up. Hopefully one of these guys are a medic. Otherwise, Op4 is now seriously crippled from a two-man duo. Looks like he woke back up. Yeah, watch the multi-stream if you want their comms. Meanwhile, some of them are actually pulling back. Um, our pilot apparently desynced in the chopper. And he got unconscious and... Uh, well, yeah. Great. Cool story, bro. What do you want from me? Moving. So I'm gonna have him Up move back. back. Here's the thing. I'd be a lot more sympathetic if they were doing this AO properly. But the fact that both teams have gone right up to the main fucking entrance just puts a bad taste in my mouth. I'm not gonna help them keep assaulting the AO improperly. That's just me, though. People get on my nerves pretty easily when it comes to this stuff because th there's a right way to do it and there are so many wrong ways to do it. Literally anywhere else, though, would have been better than the main fucking entrance. Yeah, this does deserve IED butterflies, but I'm not there yet. I'm close, but I'm not there yet. Regardless, the next AO is going to be smaller and much more light. Does it deserve a kill command? No, I'm not going to intentionally start killing them off yet. Independent have fallen back, but I don't know where they've, like, they're not being, you know, consistent here. See, Independent, now they're doing the AO right. They're assaulting this little objective. They're clearing it out slowly. He has a gun pointed on him. And they just have to push in. Hey. Uh, how late are you? You're about an hour and 15 minutes late. <laughs> Was downloading mods for Fallout 4. Just gave Deathclaw's power armor. Yeah. Sounds about light. <laughs> That's something I would do in something like this. So right now it's anyone's game. It's leaning more towards independent because now instead of assaulting from the main fucking entrance, they're assaulting from the right area. So now they just have the main garrison of the mechs to deal with. And then they can just go in, steal one, and go. Easy as that. Let's yeah, let's give him a warm we have rogue now. Spetsnaz and British troops trying to steal U.S. shit. That's the good thing to go. I unique plays. Welcome. I hope you can play better than these guys today. Good God. So let's dead start. walkers down. Well. Twenty-eight doc. Welcome. These guys do need some doctors. And that would be a one-one-three firing off. And I just somehow clicked out of the stream again. Fuck me. And it just put me up here. Cool. So that uh, MG burst killed Dead Goal right there. That would be a burst probably from over here, either this 113 or this 113. Hard to tell, but it came from this direction. However, they're still at a higher likelihood to get to the damn AO to uh, compare to Op 4, which are. They're both kind of waiting, though. I've, I've got. No choice but to send in my next so Vic. Let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? So let's get it crewed with another team. 
Sergeant Fanta, welcome. See, they're already Let's eager to go. Off. They're already fucking going for it. So, let's give them a warm welcome. And Bran Muff, welcome. On the way. So, I'm going to roll them up to where the normal QRF spot was other than the front of the goddamn base, but... These guys need to get their boys up and go. Uh, I might enable Blue Force tracking for the next one, because they're, you know, slowly leaving people behind. Otherwise, at this rate, that BTR might actually get here. Not sure if it's going to do much good, though. Auntie's also moving in. FR's in the corner. Yeah, this has got a lot of high command. Not good. This is high command send traffic. Do the pilot spots have the ability to repair vehicles? Is it, are they that is an A firm, they do. Let's, uh, let's give them a warm Thank welcome, you. shall we? Mudra, welcome. So that's the next Vic coming up. It looks like they're going to... We'll make it easier. We'll have them come up at the main entrance to give them more of an opening. But seriously, pop, smoke, and run. That's what they need to do right now. Just pop, fucking, smoke, and go. Deadwalker perishes. These two op four guys have been spending an eternity right here. At this rate... I don't know where to send my reinforcements because both of them are pretty badly pinned down, but my artillery is pretty much fucked. This is why I didn't move Gavalor, because look, he's immediately going to get thrown out of the TFAR channel again. And I had to spend the entire op babying that. So that fix coming back. Ah... Yeah, so nobody went down. What the hell are you firing at? Are you firing at me? Dumbass. Alright, let's get this team out. Hey, dumbass, you're offloading troops. That doesn't mean you back up into them. You killed one. Good job. We'll send that squad over here, we'll send you up here, and we'll send you in here. Because you guys have been in here for fucking ever. Red Lauren, welcome. The only way you're getting that fucker is from elevation. They both have their rockets out. Hit in the ass. It looks like that was a miss. Infantry not pushing in. Get them both. Ah, uh, shame. Now it's up to if either of them wake up, but that gunner will quickly take care of them. Now it's up to Independent, who are the only faction still in the AO and kicking. Otherwise, it's going to fall to the Op4 team. Green4 are just taking boats now. Rest in peace, that. On the way. Now we have this guy's coming in. I'm gonna say any roaming patrol now way. just needs. We're we're just gonna stomp this. I'm about to take. Here's the deal. If, and none of them really make them. Or if this, if Frosty gets killed, I'm gonna take one of the mechs and move him out of the AO. Because by now, these guys are about to breach. Let's 
do it. Let's, uh, let's get if they even know on. how. Master, welcome. to speaking of goat team six it looks like they have successfully broken away from the mainland and are now moving across the ocean floor to dominate as the predators they so are ay 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 guys it's not hard just you just go in where the hesco barriers are open and you shoot people Underwater AA. It's a fucking submarine. Meanwhile, Op 4 are finally taking uh, BTR. It's crewed with four people. Let's, uh, let's give them a warm welcome, shall we? Actually, it's crewed with everybody. And they're going to move in accordingly. Corey, welcome. This is kind of Op 4's last chance, but I'm waiting to see if these two guys get wiped. But they're going to have a lot to clear out here. Ah, uh, where's that M113? Where'd she move to? Yeah, you, you're pretty much fucked right there. Roger. Other M113, let's move you up. Does the AI act different really? Nah, it's really just their role. So it appears you guys might have a slight issue here. Let's, uh, let's give them a warm welcome, shall we? Where's my suppressive fire order? Fire support. A BTR in the middle of my fucking AO. Oh, how this has fallen. Technically, no one spotted it yet, but we can hear something. why you don't freaking clip yourself in the vehicles in Arma 3, kids. I think we just found our next fucking deja vu moment. Lovely. How the game never seems to surprise me. Anyway, Frosty tried to climb the open area. He failed. <clears throat> ah, they're just gonna move. And I'm surprised that Vic did not cook off from that. Was there even any damage? No damage. And Azeroth fights a 50 cal, and the 50 cal wins. No surprise. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna need to find quick cover. They just took three fucking rockets from what I heard. Uno, dos, trace. NATO doesn't mess around. They're gonna need to fuck off real quick. She's on fire. Get out. Get out and run. And explosion. And that killed everybody. And Andrew goes down. Why? Because we drove right in the middle of a military base and expected no consequences. Oh. Oh. All right, hold on. I promise is a promise. Let's fly one of these puppies out of here. Hold 
Gavlon, out of my way. This is Gavlon, high command, I'll copy. This is high command, send traffic. <clears throat> I'm doing the standard procedure for ES refueling, but it isn't working. Could you uh, give me a little hand here, because this isn't working. Saw copy, refuels two minutes. Copy that, I'll just sit here. Uh, wait one. This is High Command, I'm refueling your bird now. Peace, Gush. Ah, alright. Let's get out of storage mode. High mode. Three, two, one. Stop it. Don't land me on a house. Awesome. Ah, let's get her moved out. We'll just jump her off the island and call this a win. For me, three vehicles left. She's jumped. Now I just got to fly her over. Let's, uh, let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? The only issue with this thing is it gives a slight bit of desync. Call in, welcome. <laughs> Emergency landing. And we just got a touchdown. You can just see the desync. There we go. Ah, she's a fun puppy. Now, I'm pretty sure with that boat, I may... Why did they have it up in the surface where I could see them? They had it as an STV and I just outright annihilated it. Lovely. So they're dropping this in. Auntie! Auntie! There's a chopper! You can finally shoot at it if you want to! Take the shot. Take the shot. Does he have reinserts? Nah, it's just the pilot. Auntie, come on. Take the shot. Okay, I guess she's just waiting. Yeah, this thing doesn't have three seats, you bumblefucks. And the Bushmasters are engaging from the Bradleys. This is High Command. Be advised, mission will be considered fail in 15 minutes. I repeat, both factions have 15 minutes to secure a mech. Copy. Oh, it might put me above. Like, these got. How did it put you two up? The fuck? How did you guys get up there?
So in reality, in, it's it's only up to independent. Op 4 are taking a boat, but this is going to be kind of their last pushes here. I'm going to mobilize, grab another medic, or mech. Might have just ran that pilot Sorry, over, but whatever. Warm welcome, shall we? Savage life, welcome. Where's GOAT Team 6? They're fucking underwater. <laughs> let's, uh, let's give them a warm welcome, shall we? And Grom Dog, welcome. Let's, uh, let's give them a warm welcome, shall we? Op 4 grounded their boat. You're kidding. Brutal, welcome. Hold. You can't be serious. You can't be serious, guys. Op 4, I'm gonna say it again, you're fucking retarded. Put me in high mode. Shall we go now? Who the hell just fired at me? Whatever, they're not our primary concern. Our primary concern is getting these goddamn mechs out of here. Sinking like a motherfucker in this Sounds flight like mode. mode. <laughs> Some sort of air acid out there, according to my radar. And I'm stuck up there. Only me. Welcome to the Zeus interface. Lovely. Well, whenever he decides to get... I didn't even kill him. It was just the AI. Well, I'm sure he'll decide to get down sooner or later. Oh, God! Okay, maybe, maybe not fuck me like that, please. Are we gonna come down now? Rube wants to give an honest excuse for his team's incompetence. Ha! Ah, funny. Maris, welcome. That's why I don't like the flight mode on these things. It just, it desyncs to hell when you get up there. <laughs> it's just stuck. Can't hear anyone off the right. Oh my god. Here's the thing. They can go through. Uh, no, they can't even go through that way because there's a freaking land. So what? Did you idiots also fail land nav? Ah. Uh, don't worry. He already knows he's retarded. <laughs> See me. Pull me back on the fucking ground, Scotty. Come on. Uh, let's give him a warm welcome. Adam, welcome. But as you can see, if anyone's thinking about practical use for this thing, it's not... It's not the best for people with a bunch of servers. Now, will that kill me? It might kill me. It didn't kill me. It's not even letting me move. I'm going to do a quick server cleanup because the server is just desyncing too much. Put 
that one technically gets away. Yes, yes, not a boat, not a boat. Ah, uh, let's just start deleting shit. And our precious goats, we'll be keeping those. Uh, otherwise, you know, three guys, that's actually, they're pretty well fucking hidden. Other than that, eight minutes left. Do you not even have a gun? What is this bumblefuckery turning into, for fuck's sake? I can't even fire it because it's underwater. <laughs> I was thinking, you know, if you're if you're AA and you're on the ocean floor, does this boat count as a target? <laughs> uh, otherwise, these guys are really screwing up Royale here. Like they're gonna take this Vic back. Most of them are in this bird, and they're both gonna now get at the AO in the same time for one last attempt. Gavilor's flying on standby in between the base and them. He's waiting to hunt. Do crabs think fish can fly? That's a good question. <clears throat> Oh, look, this guy's running back because he remembered he didn't have a gun. Look at that. Word of the day. The letter of day is B, and the word of the day is bumblefuckery. Serial killer, love that name. Welcome to the Zeus interface. Here's the deal. If it gets to six minutes, I'm going to take the freaking two max. One I'm going to get away with, and the other, like, I'll just fly over towards the ocean. The other, I'm going to just pile it in and kill everything. I'm going to fucking full ammo that damn boat. Dead Gull goes down again and kills himself. Dead Walker. He goes in. All right, here's the deal. In four minutes, I'm fueling all of these and sending them in. We're just going full anti-base on this. Yeah, if this thing had ammo, that boat would be dead. But they're just charging in. They're going to take a lot of fucking heat for that. Let's, uh, let's give them a warm welcome, shall we? Dummy. Dumpy. Oh, average. Let's do that. Welcome to the Zeus interface. Purposefully beaching the boat. Let's, uh, let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? And it looks like Gavilor just ended the independent faction. <laughs> nice. Alright, and the blast person to follow. Thank you. Sorry, I was checking that out. Independent are fucked. It's up to Op 4. And they're pretty much fucking themselves. Yeah, they're doing D-Day. I'll give them a chance, but if I see them down to two units, I'm gonna just crew that damn frigate's ammo and we're gonna be done. Actually, Let's, uh, I have a better a idea. Marcy, welcome. If they can't do it in five minutes, just gonna send in the boys. Yeah, I'm gonna walk the mech over and kill them. So, it's 441, they have till 445. I'm not gonna walk it, I'm gonna do a fucking weapons test. <clears throat> Tick, tick, tick. Rube has already killed himself. I don't know why. No, wait. If Rube's already killed himself, that means none of these guys are medics. 
Nah, we don't need to make a PID clusterfuck. They've already clusterfucked this themselves. All right, Mr. Boat, I've got a job for you. They're running in, the machine gun's literally tearing them apart. Yeah, I just don't fly with the desync, I agree. Yep, they're getting fucked. Fuck it, let's go. I'm gonna use the Zeus interface to bring it out, I'm done. Let's do it. Why are you having me in one direction? Come on. She's a bit annoying, isn't she? Blood lost the bodies. So, All right, that's enough. This is high command to both ma uh, factions. Be advised, mission is fail. I repeat, mission is fail. I'm going to quickly restart the server. We're going to get the server restarted, uh, get this underway. <sighs> the mech's not OP. It's actually fairly balanced, but... Um... Andrew, put my... Andrew, fix your up, Mike. Javalo, did you shoot me in the pony? <clears throat> yes. Fuck you, bitch. Did anyone get the thing? You were 50 Did meters we above the air. Yeah. Nobody, nobody, nobody won. Break. Break. Nobody won. We're gonna we do one more mission. We Break. We're, all we're gonna do another mission. Oh. Okay. Uh, it's gonna be the same thing, but I'm gonna make the garrison much easier this time because you guys decided to assault the base from the front fucking entrance, which I'm surprised both teams did that, and that's why the op became extremely difficult. Because you're not Party. supposed to do that. Wait, Barty, when wait, I make a Christian. suggestion, when I make a suggestion, Barty, not to attack the outpost front on, and that I refuse to pilot and do get you guys that close, please listen to me next time. <laughs> please. Also, uh, second away. thing, second thing. Um, there was a lot of AA cover after the first assault. That was because someone shot down a chopper right above the airbase, and that mobilized all the choppers. So, good one. Let's, uh, let's that wasn't that. Well, Till, uh, was welcome. Boy. I'm pretty sure that was FR, to be yeah, perfectly honest. I saw a boat from uh, Redfall and I was like, this is too easy. Next minute. I'll be beep, back. Beep, 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 beep. Let's, uh, let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? I'll have I saw a speed on by, but... Go fee, welcome. Oh, Deep will be doing uh, a second uh, mission in a second. As the best drivers. Yeah. No, I'm now. Just say, is, <laughs> no, is the day international door listen to Gav we'll I tell you not to drive, on, not to like, Kickstarter the boat Thank you. Language. So they drive the boat onto the land. Yeah, we need to get I the face rig. It's almost do done. Assault. Oh, let's do an aerial assault. I'll tell them we'll get <laughs> Just the money will help me pay for oh, what Gavilo, it's going to be. Gavilo, 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 how about this? Well, at least you had a if you got, lead, independent did not have any. If you if you have so much negativity, maybe you should inject some positivity. Like, uh, uh, who was it? Our commander was not We, I would say one thing. Uh, we did actually breach the compound. Yes, you breached the compound. That, that, good start. Good start. You did like basic. <laughs> yeah, that, that, well, you made it. Uh, uh, Leary, a quick question. Out. 
to our beach landing? Why was there an APC right when we walked up onto the beach? I mean, there's no way that thing could have known you were there. Uh, that was right at the main entrance, which was 15 feet away from your LZ. So, exactly. yeah. No, I, mean, I, meant, I, meant, I, meant the, I meant the water the, 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 when we dived in. Yeah, That's you where... dived in 15 feet from the fucking entrance. Oh, we didn't know where the entrance was when we were swimming. There. The so entrance has a map. road that goes into the base. <laughs> Do not no, fucking tell me you don't know what an GPS. entrance is. <laughs> you fucking retarded, uh, cheeky guys, dick waffle son of a bitch. Um, uh, good wait. job. I know, guys, I'm... Continue now, continue. No, you, you first. Oh. Okay, All I'm going to say, next time, guys, if you want...